Hey guys, in this video I'll show you how to put a CompuStar 2-way remote in vibrate mode, set the time and temperature units, and I'll go over the other menu options on this T9 remote. So to enter the remote menu, I'm going to hold down the unlock button and the trunk buttons together. And remote menu should show up on the screen, and the time will be flashing. So the first option is the clock. To change the remote clock, press the lock button to increase the hours and press the unlock button to increase the minutes. To go to the next option, press the key button. So the next option is the engine start time. You can automatically start the car at this time by using timer mode, but it must be programmed first. Then I go to the next option. This is the alarm clock. So here's the time you would set for the alarm clock to beep if you want the remote to beep every day at a certain time. Press the key button again, and you can set the alarm clock on and off by pressing the lock button. Let's go to the next option. This is the RPS pager. If you have an RPS pager and you don't want it to page this remote, you can set it to off here, and then the remote won't beep when the pager is calling. The next option is vibrate. You can set it to on by pressing the lock button and then the remote will vibrate instead of beep. Press the key button again. The temperature units are here. You can set between Fahrenheit and Celsius. So I'll leave it on Celsius and let's go to the next one. This is for the auxiliary output. So if you want the sliding doors to operate on the auxiliary output, you can leave that to on, or you can set that to off. I don't really have anything hooked up to the auxiliary output. And the last option is the display timeout, which is set to 6 seconds, but I can increase it to 9 or 12 seconds, so the display will stay on for 12 seconds after it lights up, and then it will turn off. And that was the last option. Now to exit the menu, Hold the unlock button and the trunk button together again. And I have it programmed. I'll press the key. And it's vibrating and it's showing the units in Celsius. If you found this video useful, please make sure to give it a thumbs up and consider subscribing to my channel. I'll be posting more videos in the future. Thanks for watching.